The Dodger Stadium offers takoyaki. Oh. oh. Gindako. Gindako. Dukiji Gindako. Gindako. <laughs> Maji. Team Duck to bring back their VTuber Gargura to Dodger Stadium. Gargura? Their anime character shouted out the traditional it's time for Dodger baseball. <laughs> <laughs> I, I think that it's not very palatable to the American mindset to have anime characters at yeah. an American tradition. Wow. Wow. <laughs> so God damn. Today, Otani fans will be the Let's find out. Damn, wow, why did you bring this topic for you love Otani Sensei? Yeah. I didn't know you were such a baseball fan. Yeah, what the heck? Why did you ever bring us to a baseball game? Yeah. <laughs> 日本でもね、大スターの大谷選手、ま、今もドジャースでアメリカでね、あの大活躍されてるんですけども、アメリカでも大スターということで、バイロンがいろいろ調べてくれて、で、ドジャーススタジアムはどこにあるんだったっけ
たこ焼きおーわいたこ焼き Well, I mean, that's the thing. I think that in America, people like sushi, they like ramen, and then very, very few know about takoyaki, right? In, in LA, we have this thing called the 626 Night Market. But then, you know, you're not gonna have mentaiko at a 626 Night Market, you're not gonna have iburigako, you're not gonna have very, like, ura ura. Ura, 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 ura. No, washoku, right? And I think that the next thing available is something fried, something doused with mayo,、uh, yeah, and yeah. unagi sauce. It's very easy to sell to Americans. Batter, we have deep fried Oreos, we have Twinkies, <laughs> right? Okay, batter, mayo, unagi sauce. And so, takoyaki seems very palatable, therefore, we have gindako at the Dodger Stadium. And get this. One of the special flavors that we have there is avocado and cheese. <laughs> <laughs> avocado and cheese takoyaki. Very,、uh, very Californian. Very Californian. Very Californian. California, to you, but avocado to cheese. I guess so. Uh, it's, uh, it's like Mexican. Mexican. <laughs> Mexican. <laughs> Mexican. <laughs> South, Southwest、uh, cuisine. I read this interview where ABC was interviewing this Japanese person who went to go to see Shohei and she was getting her opinion. On how she thought about the avocado and cheese takoyaki. And she said, it has good American taste. And I'm like, that's not a compliment. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think she's trying to compliment you. I'm like, I'm like, that is not a homemade kotoba for sure. Yeah, from what I know. <laughs> yeah, okay. When you go see a match, what do you get? You get hot dogs and beer, right?、Mm-hmm. And what Japanese food would go well with it? You're not gonna have sushi. I feel like takoyaki places very well next to those two. Ah,、uh, that's right. It's very easy to Complimentary. eat. Complimentary.、Right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. No one can use chopsticks, but they can use sumayoji.、Mm. And、yeah. they can do this. <laughs> <laughs> Battered dice octopus. It's all with various garnishes. Dice octopus. Yo, $16. Whoa, $16? Get out of here. How much do we get? $16.99. That's $17. Plus tax? Plus tip, probably? Oh my god, it's $20. Bucks. $20 bucks for six? How much do we get at. High b o l l High b o l l $20. What happened to America, dude? I thought. This is, this is the current state of America, Aaron. Yeah, man. This is the、crazy. current state of America. Takoyaki is six, no, $17. <laughs> I guess it's like a specialty exotic import food, I guess. That's right. right. That's、yeah. why it's that expensive. I suppose. Yo, man. Look、oh. at that guac, though. I can see it. It's overflowing.、Yeah. It must be good. Guacamole and takoyaki must be sick. Oh, yeah. k i r e k i r e Man, look at that view, I can tell the person who got this is Japanese <laughs> because they didn't get the avocado and cheese. <laughs> they got the most basic. I'm going to say, 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 I'm <laughs> I mean, I, mean, I know I, that. Maybe it's like taco from tacos? There's no way. That's, that. that's There's no There way is、it. definitely a m e r i c a n who thinks that, for sure. That's、oh, it's like taco. I love, I love old El Paso, dude. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, I love El Pollo Loco. Oh, <laughs> Yaki? It's probably like Japanese Mexican fusion. First time I went to a taco party. Taco p a r t I thought it was gonna be a tacos party. Yeah, get out. That's the problem. I thought it was gonna be a tacos party. I thought it was gonna be a tacos party. I thought it was gonna be a tacos party. I thought it was gonna be a tacos party. That's pretty sick. It's just all due to our boy, man. Because people want to go for the Japanese, man. Therefore, they need to pair it with a Japanese food. It's true.、Yeah. Yeah. Otai Shohei is making、uh, Japan great again, one might say. That's right. <laughs> He is. Gindako ga Doja Stadium ni dekita de shita. Before we move on to the next topic, I just want to say that takoyaki is not the only thing that is available at the Dodger Stadium. Well, they have to. We also have chicken katsu sandwiches. Chicken Look katsu. Chicken、uh, katsu. And of course, Americans would love this because you know why? We have 
teriyaki sauce, a very fried cutlet in the middle, and QP mayonnaise. Mm. Oh. Delicious. Also, yes. it, between two slices of bread. Correct. Yeah. That's Americans very possible. love sandwiches. We Americans do. love sandwiches. Nikomet! Coors Light Reactive Marketing. <laughs> no! Okay, let me explain. Recently, um, Shohei Otani has hit a bunch of homers, and uh, in recent news, he has hit one of the Coors Light panels during mm. an advertisement. And Coors Light had this amazing idea for their a very good Kikan Gente version of their beer. Anyway, I'll let the video tell you guys oh. more. Oh my wow. god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Yes, yeah, this is when he was playing for the Angels, right? And this is not directly connected to the Dodgers stadium, but I think that what this video wants to entail is his eight kill on just all of pretty much America at this point, and even affecting Coors Light in this way. And I am upset that I did not get my hands on this can and I could sell it for $170 on That would be pretty sick, yeah. Yeah, that would be, that would be cool. This is not Dodgers, Angel Stadium in Anaheim, California, where Disneyland is. Yeah. 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 If this same thing happens in Japan, like if he hits a homer and then it hits the Asahi super dry Kanban and he breaks it, would that kind of reactive marketing happen in Japan? <laughs> really? This is a American feel in Japan. Japan is fast and fast. Japanese people are yeah. America. So, yeah, they're the professional YouTuber. <laughs> okay, that was a uh, Coors Light reactive marketing dish top. All right, guys, you ready? Yeah. So come here. Dodger Stadium features VTubers. Oh. Oh. Okay, everybody know what a VTuber is. What is what, what's a VTuber? I don't know what a VTuber is. I don't know what a VTuber is. I'm pretty sure. He's in the eye. Yeah, no. Kizuna Ai is probably the, for, for okay, one okay, of the okay, first things. You, can't, you can't name drop people. I don't, okay. Sorry. <laughs> what, what, what is a VTuber? Sorry. Okay, okay. This is this is probably easy to understand. So this is a person. They have motion tracking. It's a very advanced motion tracking. So they track their face. Like if they blink, then this this character blinks. Oh, okay. you know, this if they Move smile, around. then they smile. Right. So it's a virtual YouTuber. Oh. There's this company called Hollow Live, and yeah. they sponsor all of these different VTubers. Now, the world is very popular. Oh really? Like Hollow Live, the the Japanese company. Yeah. They're a Japanese company, and they do mainly Japanese YouTubers, but they also have have a branch that does VTubers only in English. So actually, the company that collaborated with the Dodgers Stadium is Hollow Live. It's Hollow Live, right? It's yeah, Hollow yeah, Live, yeah, and yeah. then they. I, I, I get that now. Yeah. And then a VTuber went to the Dodgers Stadium on the screen. Obviously, yeah. you can't have a hologram on the screen. Yeah. And she sang. Take me out to the ball game. Oh. Do you know that song though? Take, take me out to the ball game. game. Take me out to the crowd. Yeah. Buy me some peanuts and crackers, oh, Jacks. I don't care if we'll ever get back. back. My daughter. 
for the home team. So it was VTuber が歌ったってこと I guess so. Yeah. でもその VTuber っていうのは超日本のものだから一応ね。That's right. それをね球場でやってるってこと。Yes. Yeah, yeah. Hey, just show it, show it. That's crazy because like I've never heard of an anime character showing up at the yes. Dodger Stadium, that is, that is crazy. A, yeah. an American yeah. staple. Yeah. Right? Yeah. It's like tell, it's like trying to tell your white friend that has not been introduced <laughs> to any anime at all, going like, "Hey, have you heard of VTubing, bro? No way in heck are they gonna get into that at all." Right? Like, it's so hard to get into anime, first of all, and you just give them like VTubers instantaneously. Like, it's hard to make that high. On that basis, right? Showing, trying to put this at the Dodger Stadium is unreal. And I think it's all due to our Mr. Otani Senshu. Anyway, here it is. The Dodgers' most famous fan may not be real, but she could help the team with millions of new fans. See, last week, the Los Angeles Dodgers and Japanese Red Live teamed up to bring popular VTuber Gargura to Dodger Stadium. Gargura? The anime character shouted out the traditional It's Time for Dodger Baseball and even sang Take Me Out to the Ball Game. Take Me Out to the Ball Damn. Now, on the surface, this might seem like an odd collaboration, but it's actually genius for two reasons. First, Gura is the most popular VTuber in the world. 4.49 mil, damn. damn. More than us, guys, see? Oh, damn. Which is more than the Dodgers have on YouTube and Instagram combined. The announcement of the promotion alone generated 3.4 million views on X. But by far yeah, the most、yeah. interesting part of this is that Gura's fan base actually overlaps quite well with the type of demographic the Dodgers are hoping to reach. Half of the animated characters' YouTube Viewers are age 24 or younger, and 90% are male, giving the Dodgers access to a demo that has become tougher and tougher for MLB teams to attract. And this promotion at the ballpark didn't just give that large online audience exposure to the Dodgers and newly acquired Japanese stars Shohei Otani and Yoshinobu Yamamoto, because the MLB club also offered collaborative trading card sets around Guru and Guru for $125 on eBay. Whoa! T-shirts are currently selling for as high as $195 bucks, given the potential. Crossover of a Japanese audience that loves anime characters like Gura and baseball, the Dodgers might have just found a way to get millions of new fans interested in their team. That's crazy. That is unreal. That is unreal. unreal, dude. This is super. Awana is a VTuber and a football. And America is like. いや、でも日本の野球スタジアムでも、あの VTuber が出てたら、おお、すげえなって多分なると思うけど、uh-huh. それをアメリカでやってるっていうのが。That is pretty crazy. Because I'm real. I think like the, the guy who did, made this video did have a good point on the genius, because the American Association of Baseball, they're trying to get more fans, right? Yeah. And The subscribers of、uh, the most subscribed YouTuber of all life, it's exactly the target audience that they want to have as new fans, you know?、Mm-hmm. Like males under 24 and Japanese, they know about Shohei Otani. Baseball in the American consciousness, let's、yeah. say, his, like collective consciousness. Always feels like, like a really historical, traditional, old, old, old thing. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. It's, it's kind of like. What's, what's the Japanese equivalent? I don't know, like tatami or something like that. It's, it's, like, it's like something that's like so embedded in Japanese or in American culture that it's so hard to remove from it, right? And so I'm sure there are some people out there. Um, some, some people in like rural Pennsylvania, let's say, who were like, see this like daughter's stadium. What the hell is going on at daughter's stadium? Like,、mm-hmm. Where's the real baseball? Like, I'm sure there's some people <laughs> out there who are like, probably upset about this, right? Yeah, I can, I can see where you're just going to do that. Because,、right? like, because not only is Baseball, like, so American.、Mm-hmm. It's like the probably next to apple pie, it's like the most American thing in existence, <laughs> right? And then you have, like, first of all, there's like foreign players playing in the、mm-hmm. American League, and then now they have like this Hall of Life thing. They're like, what the fuck is like, going on? I, 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 I think know, that I, it's not very palatable to the American mindset to have anime characters at、yeah. an American tradition, right? It's like having anime characters kick off the 4th of July. For all、yeah. of America. So I feel like well done, Dodgers, for taking that risk and it paying off. Because I feel like that, wouldn't, that risk wouldn't pay off in other places. Yeah. yeah. It, it, also, it also makes sense because earlier I was saying that a lot of Japanese tourists are going to the baseball stadium.、Yeah. And on that note, Hollow Live is not the only person to have come to perform at the Dodger Stadium. Oh, no. Do you guys know、uh, X Japan? Oh, what actually? Okay. Yeah. X Japan. X Japan.、Uh, from X Japan, we had this guy named、uh, 
Yoshiki. Yeah. Do the oh, national yeah. anthem. What? It's actually the American national anthem. He did not sing the national anthem, but he played it on piano. You guys want to see? Oh, yeah. yes. Dodger Stadium. Yoshiki. 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 I like that. Yes. American announcer. Yeah, that's pretty good. Why it's more a piano though? This was this April, guys. Yeah, that's pretty good. This oh year. my god, look at that flag. There we go. <laughs> The American National Anthem yeah. is one of the greatest sayings I've ever heard in my life. Dude, it is. Like, yeah, we can talk about Coldplay, we can talk about fucking Jimi Hendrix, blah, blah, blah. The Star Spangled Banner, dude, oh my god. Star Spangled Banner, yeah. Probably top three best song ever made in the world. Dude. In the history of music. Dude. Hands down. God. No context. For that to be the National no Anthem, context. man, I'm so proud. <laughs> and I'm proud to be an American, <laughs> where at least I know I'm free. すごいと思うのがナショナルアンセムってアメリカ人にとってめちゃくちゃ大切なものじゃん。イエス。日本のアーティストがドジャーススタジアムに行って演奏するってなんかすごいな。Well, I mean, I think I think what they did here is really tasteful, right? Cuz yeah. like if he sang it, it would probably be a different reaction. まあそう but, but the fact that he's like playing it on piano, it's like I feel like that's a very much of a universal language, you know what I mean? Yeah. It kind of transcends Boundaries, yeah. yeah, so. Oh. Don't Fergie the national anthem. <laughs> oh, that's right. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that's yeah. Right. Yeah. Don't do too much with the national anthem. Just just sing it, dude. Yeah, dude. As is. Uh, anyway, that was VTuber. That was uh, Gargura from Hollow Live and Yoshiki from X Japan. <laughs> Alright, TV! Da -da -da -da. The Dodger Stadiums! Outrageous ticket prices. Oh, da -da -da -da. No. no, no. Well, of course, how, how else are you going to pay that $7 million salary? That's true, yeah. How are you going to do that? you got to yeah, raise right. the ticket prices. Right? Okay, well, luckily this person on TikTok did the math for us so that we don't have to. How the hell are the Dodgers supporting $1.5 billion to Otani, Yamamoto, and company? There's a number of reasons, but perhaps the easiest to understand might be Dodger Stadium itself. Dodger Stadium is the largest ballpark by capacity in Major oh, League so Baseball. Damn. Oakland Coliseum technically can seat more, but they usually tarp off the entire upper bowl because of a lack of fans. Oh. The Dodgers averaged 47,371 fans last year. That's 6,509 more fans than the second highest team. Yes. The average ticket price for a Dodger game last season, 171 bucks. Oh, so whoa. Hold on, hold on, hold on. <laughs> How much is a ticket in like Osaka for the Heisen Tigers? Good for you. <laughs> yeah. average. Let's look at that in yen. Go, Fuji. <laughs> to see the Dodgers. <laughs> Worth it. So, like five times the yes. price of Japan. You gotta see your boy. Yeah, you're gonna hit a home run. Yeah, yeah. You're guaranteed a home run. <laughs> okay? You're guaranteed it at the game. The average ticket price for a Dodger game last season, 171 bucks. <laughs> oh, so, 6,500 more fans multiplied by $171 fans. multiplied by 81 total home games. That equals $90.5 million. <laughs> for perspective, Otani, Freddie Freeman, Mookie Betts, and Yoshinobu Yamamoto's salaries combined next year is 86 million dollars <laughs> meaning that extra 90 million is more than enough to pay for the salaries of their four best players now this is just one piece of the income equation there are broadcast deals tax brackets handful of others but the dodger stadium size alone is capable of paying for their most expensive player god damn yeah, yeah. yeah. oh my gosh that's just the ticket just the ticket <laughs> Um, I'm pretty sure inflation has increased the price of baseball oh. tickets. I definitely don't remember paying $171 for 
as baseball tickets uh, so nice. to go see yeah. that. Even in, even in Toronto, Toronto Blue Jays, I don't think, I definitely did not pay over $100 for that ticket. Definitely yeah, not. I remember paying like 60 or like 80 yeah. when I used to live in the States, but never $171. I'd rather go to Disneyland. In this ABC News article, uh, it says specifically how many Japanese tourists were welcomed into the U.S. in 2023. Would you like to know that number? Come on, tell us. Yes. All right. In 2023, LA welcomed. They welcomed 230,000 visitors from Japan, which was a 91.7% increase from 2022. <laughs> That's wow. Yeah. 91.7%. Nobody so cared about LA. There was probably like a handful that cared about LA. And as soon as Otani Senshu comes to that Dodger State, guess how much parking is? Chushajo. Kurumano? Kurumano. Yojikan, right? Yojikan. But you're not saying it. Ha 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 and if you're going to be at least maybe a five minute, ten minute walk away from the convention center, you know how much av on average we paid for parking for one car? $80. Yeah, for full day parking. Oh, $80. When you split 20, 20, 20 amongst four people, 20, 20, 20, 20 amongst four people, it's not that bad. But still, unheard of. $80 for parking? Yeah. And they can, they can do that. They can do that because there's a convention and there's no other choice other than to pick this random business that is right there conveniently next to the convention center. And so there's no law saying that they can't change the prices and they, they surge like crazy. Well, that's the thing. Well, for example, you guys have Inaka, you guys have Saitama. Why don't you guys just expand to Saitama? Same problem. See, we are a Hiroi. But then there are these cities where we have a bunch of people in one city. We have a big population, just like Tokyo, just like Osaka. Right? <laughs> that was the ticket price for the Dodgers increasing. A mural has been painted in Miyako Hotel in Little Tokyo of Otani Senshu. And, 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 there's a QR code on the sidewalk, mm. and if you scan it on your phone, he moves. He hits oh. a homer for you. He hits a homer for you. Okay. What are you talking about, land of technology and a land of forwardness? I will show you what the, the power of the QR code. You guys invented the QR code. That's right. Then for some name. Hallelujah. 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 Alright, so as I told you guys earlier, at the Miyako Hotel, there is a QR code that you can scan on the sidewalk, and the mural moves and hits a homer for you. <laughs> Old Tani Senji hits a homer for you. Check this out. <laughs> God damn. That's so That's cool! This is the influence our boy has on the city of LA. A mural painted in his name, the food, the prices, <laughs> the culture, Hollow Live, X Japan coming to uh, the Dodger Stadium. He's done all of this in such a short amount of time. And arguably, I think we've talked about this off camera, the most popular Japanese export is anime. Mm. The next popular Japanese export is. Shohei Otani. That's right. Yeah. That's right. はい、ということで今日は大谷翔平選手がアメリカの球場を変えた伝説ということでバイロン先生に話していただきました。お疲れ様でした。The standard that maybe Ichido started, right? Oh, maybe Japanese players are really good, mm -hmm. right? And then and Shohei Otani comes around, it's like, oh my god, these people, like, they developed some really, really great players. And I feel like from now on, you're going to see more and more Japanese players coming to the MLB, I think, because of 
what started Ichido and now Shohei Otani. There's like so. there's like a really good guy, a really short NBA player now. Yeah, he's Japanese. That, he's plays yeah. for the, uh, the Grizzlies. He plays for the Grizzlies. Yeah, and yeah. he is freaking good. Yeah, yeah. He's so good. You have like these six, five, six, eight people. They can't get around him because there's this tiny little Japanese going. Yeah, and he's, he's like, like doing five, six or something. He's like that. five six, and he's doing like noble passes like this. Yeah. He's getting through, and uh, his team is like owning. Yeah. And like I saw this clip of like uh, John Morant. John Morant, he's like he's a big player for the NBA Grizzlies, and he was just like dapping him up the whole Dab- time. <laughs> yeah, you know what dapping someone up is? It's like this. It's like yo, yeah, yeah, buddy, yeah. yo. He was like that yeah. because he's just so good. He was like I think that Japan is making a new wave of athletes. Yeah. You really don't yeah. need to be that tall. In order to be a great athlete, you need to use whatever assets that you have yeah. and play. Hoka ni mina san ga obo otani senshu ga tsukutta densetsu areba komento ran made yoroshiku onegai shimasu. Sore ga ni mo boku no ni toku shite hoshii hanashi ga areba komento ran made yoroshiku onegai shimasu. Sore de wa tsuki no toka de mata omoi shimashou. Bye bye! Channel? Toroku? Onegai shimasu!